coverage you can count on. A world-renowned mixed martial arts fighter faced an Albuquerque judge today. John Bones Jones is suspected of running from a crash where a pregnant woman suffered a broken arm. And just moments ago, we spoke to the president of the UFC. Action 7 News reporter Aaron Hill joins us live from the courthouse. Yeah, Doug, that's right. UFC President Dana White is now on his way back to Las Vegas after coming to Albuquerque to meet with John Jones' lawyers. The superstar fighter facing a felony charge accused of leaving the scene of an accident, and it's not clear what that could mean for the future of Jones' career. UFC light heavyweight champion John Bones Jones is in a different kind of fight right now. The MMA star appearing in front of an Albuquerque judge facing charges from an alleged hit and run over the weekend. Not the driver of a silver SUV fled on foot from the scene. Albuquerque police suspect Jones ran a red light at Juan Tabo and Southern in the southeast Sunday morning, hitting another car and breaking a pregnant woman's arm. According to the criminal complaint, an off duty police officer ID'd the driver as John Jones and then saw the suspect run from the scene. The fighter turned himself into police more than a day later. In court, Jones's attorney asked the judge to allow him to travel as part of his release. He is a, a fighter for the UFC and he has a fight that's coming up in three weeks. The judge did not restrict his travel ability. Inside the car, police believe Jones ran from. They found a pipe with marijuana in it, rental car documents with Jones's name, and even MMA sports memorabilia. Clearly, John would prefer to be focusing on his job, which is training for this big fight, but I can tell you that John's going to do the right thing. And as for that big fight on May 23rd, the UFC says it's still reviewing the situation, and at this time, won't comment any further. Now, the district attorney's office says once they receive the completed case from police, they will review it and then decide whether to bring it to a grand jury for an indictment. As for Jones's future with the UFC, Dana White tells us he has not made any decision yet on whether Jones will face any kind of disciplinary action. We'll have more on what White had to say tonight, coming up at 6 o'clock and then again at 10. We're live in downtown. Aaron Hill, KOAT Action 7 News. One